With time, a seed becomes a tree, sheltering us. With time, a skill becomes a talent, empowering us. With time, a technology becomes a tool, enhancing us. By nature, time gives value to almost everything, yet the very thing our society gives value to, our money, loses value over time. This paradox warps our reality by defying the laws of nature, and it stems from the belief that a dollar today is worth more than a dollar tomorrow. Meaning money must always lose value, we built our reality off of this model. Time value of money, we call it, but in reality, this is just dogma. Since we can keep making more of it, we end up destroying our own purchasing power. So we put it in stocks, put it in bonds, put it in land, put it in funds, put it in crypto, put it in gold. But we are not oracles, so what do we know? We know that it's hard to get by, we know some people may never retire. Is time value of money a lie since it discounts the monetary value of our time? If time is money, how are they moving in different directions? We're working longer for less, we end up just giving away our freedom. Give up liberty for policies, give up our agency to the authorities. Cause when our foundation is built on complexity, we simplify humans by giving up our humanity. Reality check, we've strayed too far from the truth The world economy's a wreck when one plus one no longer equals to two And if life's created from the truth, along the way something got screwed And we let our own dogma subjectify value And we divorce action from consequence We defy the law of physics when we made scarcity infinite We disregard the language of mathematics So our systems are built in a fallacy Our society's based on a fantasy In the absence of truth, we're living in the shadows of our own reality And that's the root problem, man-made rules can be broken. As our trust crumbles, so does the progress of our civilization. But one thing remains constant, no one can cheat nature. So why not use it to architect a stronger base layer? The most beautiful buildings engineered based on these consequences. Natural law drives rigor needed to build something enduring and compromising on principles that account for the flaws. Because when our lives are at stake, the gravity of truth cannot be ignored. So if our monetary systems were designed like structures, it would embody energy and matter, so the money itself matters. An unbreakable limit enforced by costliness of creation ensures the structure holds value for many generations. A rule-based system governed by math builds a transparent ecosystem that can self-error correct. With no one in charge, no words are taken as fact. Only work from computation can actualize truth of timestamps and like water flowing off a cliff. Down the path of gravity, computational energy makes time flow one way only. It is this irreversibility which gives value to our money by upholding consensus and scarcity to create one shared reality. Now the map is the territory. Now we're working with high fidelity. Now money is truthfully time and energy bound by finality. Now we have the ability to manifest each of our dreams and build a world that is much more reflective of all of our needs. And that's the purpose of money, merely a tool to shape our reality, merely a function to harness and express individuality, but just a way to live freely, just a means for possibility, because when we build on integrity, we enhance the beauty of humanity. The most beautiful societies are built from diversity of our thoughts that come to life when we're empowered individually, because when our money tomorrow is worth more than today, we shift from predicting to creating the future ourselves. And when our money grows in value, we grow thoughtful in how we use it. Natural law drives rigor needed to fund something enduring, something truly worth it, something that pushes the sky's limit, something only possible when our real value and consequence exist in boundless virtual dimensions. Imagine potential creations fueled by monetary life force lasting for many generations. We will venture into new territories and unleash these possibilities once we learn to embrace the truth of our reality.